How do folks, I am the Grumpy Vlogger. And it is the 20th of June. I think I'm gonna have to do this different. Because we got neighbors and they got the, they're parked right behind me. So I wanna circle around rather than trying to, got more room here this way. But yeah, they're, this one right here. Okay. I made it. Well, they're having a big party tonight. So, anyways. So, as I said, I'm the Grumpy Vlogger. And this is Saturday, the 20th of June. Uh, caught a little bit of Kelly Shores, the end of it. Uh, speed dial with... Uh, yeah, 51 drum rust from 51 drones on there. And uh, Kelly brought up something, and I guess it's, you know, I've talked about this before when my phone's gotten hot, the uh, screen gets dark. And that jerkwad, he cuts over into my lane to go around these cars here. But I had the right of way because he was cutting into my lane. So, anyways, uh, it's Saturday. Like I said, Judy's. Normally, I don't get hamburgers on Saturdays, but Judy said she wanted one. Wow, we're doing a lot of work in that alley, putting in the new sewer line. I wonder if they're going to put any down by. If they're running that whole line or not. But so I'm running over here to Freddy's, and she said she wanted to try some onion rings. She hasn't been feeling good. Uh, she gets one thing going, and something else starts up. You know. We just, you know, it seems like we're always treating the next. You know, she got so many things wrong that you know it. Each day, it's a little something. Man, that looks like they've tore down part of that school building. Don't tell me they're working on that one too. There's something over there they tore down. But yeah, huh. Must be doing a lot of remodeling to school buildings. Uh, this this summer with everybody off right now. So yeah. Uh, also, uh, saw, I didn't see him personally, but I got to watch it on local news. Uh, President Trump is currently having a rally. The mayor of Tulsa tried to declare, you know, he, he, he tried to shut it down, is what he tried to do. And, uh, I think he pretty well got told by everything from the governor to the, you know, everybody that, nah, you're not playing that game, not in Oklahoma. But apparently when Trump came in, there were some protesters there. And that's too bad. I mean, I understand. Uh, and I, I guess they were getting kind of violent, you know. It's, uh, you know, and I've said this before. When you have a group like uh, a socialist or Marxist group like uh, Antifa and Black Lives Matters. Uh, you know, and that's, that's the other thing. A lot of people don't realize that the Black Lives Matters group is funded by a, a political action committee, uh, New Blue or something like that, or Blue Tech, or I don't know, I can't remember. Uh, I'll have to ask Art tomorrow again, because it's just sad that this is, you know, they, you know, I've said it before. In my opinion, all lives matter. Uh, the, uh, the white woman killed by the black Muslim cop in Minneapolis. You didn't see us rioting and protesting over that. Maybe we should have, but we didn't. Where was the people that were protesting that with the police department then? You know, they didn't think a thing about it. You didn't see Black Lives Matter showing up to that rally because it was a black police officer and a white woman. And, you know, that's racist in itself. I 
I mean, one of the biggest racist organizations, in my opinion, is the NCAA. And I know I'm going to catch hell over this one. But when you think about it, the, uh, the National Association for the Advancement of Colored People, that's what it stands for. That's what the NCAA stands for. And, and they are for the advancement of people of color. That excludes whites, okay? That means whites are excluded. That is an organization that practices racism. You know, and don't forget to look at your history. You got uh, you got the Klan that was started by the Democrats. The uh, uh, you know the the abolitionists and well, not what even them. There was the it was the ones still trying to hang on to their slaves. If they didn't, if they didn't tow the line, then they got uh, they got shot. You got to remember that a predominant amount of them in the South that had slaveholders were Democrats. And uh, I'm sure somebody will correct me. I'm sure somebody will point out I'm wrong. But still, get back to the NCAA. That's a racist organization. You know, pure and simple. So, so is Black Lives Matters. They're excluding other races. If you exclude another race from your organization, if you exclude them from your, your, whatever you call it, if you exclude them, then, you know, that's, that, if you exclude other races, that, that's being racist. I don't, I don't say any way, how can you not say that they're not racist? You know, if it, it makes it, but I can't say all lives matters because that's being racist. Why? Where? What does that comment have to do with being racist? All lives matter. Black, brown, yellow, white. You know, uh, all lives matter. Period. And, uh, but, you know, Black Lives Matter says if you say something like that, you're a racist. I mean, Joe Biden to talk about being insulting. He sits there and says, uh, well, if you don't, if the blacks don't vote for me, they're not really black. That's got to be one of the most ignorant statements I have ever heard in my life. And I've heard some stupid shit. That had to be one of them. And that's who the Democrats want for their president. You have got to be kidding me. Yeah, I'm going to run this one red. Oh, well. Anyways, guys, I'm the Grumpy Vlogger. If you like what you hear, if you're new here, please consider subscribing. Ring the bell so you get notifications. Give me a thumbs up if you like what I had to say in this. And uh, I will talk at you guys later. I'm about to show up at Freddy's here. So, uh, again, I'm the Grumpy Vlogger. Treat each, other better, treat each other better than you would treat yourself. Be nice to each other, and let's stop the madness, okay? And I'm the Grumpy Vlogger, and I'm out of here. Bye-bye for now.